Hi, this is Leanne with Vision RV, and I'm shooting a live video of the Sabre <clears throat> fifth wheel model 38BDQ. Uh, there is the floor plan, and right now we have it on sale. So it was 109. And then we cut the price to 107 and now it's 96, which is really nice. So just check out quickly the outside here. You can see it. And then we'll take a quick walk around on the outside. So as you can see, nice big wide doors. Um, really lovely, actually. You don't have to end these solid steps. Which is really nice. So we're just going to go inside here. And check out the inside. So right off the get-go, as soon as you walk in, you're in the kitchen living room area, okay? So um, here you have a beautiful pantry, nice and a lot of space, like great space. And I love how it brings like that country vibe to it yet modern very modern you have a nice uh, little station right here with uh, ports for your phone plus outlets so you can put your coffee pot on here crock pot you know all that good stuff right there and then of course a whole bunch of storage in here as well and then up here as well a lot of storage in this one of course you have your saber is known for their zebra blinds so you do are able to control the light with these blinds which is nice right you can control how much light goes in and out of course you got your couch here which uh, is on a really nice slide which folds out into a bed and <clears throat> and it's it's a nice kind of leather material so that's really lovely as well. You got your kitchen table here. No dinette, just your kitchen table with extra storage under the chairs in the chair seats. And then this big, beautiful island with outlets and phone ports there. But you got this really lovely island, so you could even get some bar stools, put some bar stools around there. You got a very nice deep sink with, of course, your blowout there and your hand sanitizing station right there. Nice deep farm style sink and a solid, solid counters like these are solid counters. Of course, a lot of storage, of course, in this island as well. And then underneath here, too, for any kind of cleaning products that you need. You got a nice big microwave. <clears throat> With your turntable. Storage everywhere. Everywhere. So then you got that pantry, but you also have another pantry over here too, which is handy. So you got this extra pantry as well in there. And then of course you got your fireplace and your TV right here. So you can be sitting on the couch, enjoying your fireplace and your TV too. storage up here and these are nice deep cupboards a lot of storage in there tv turns and alternates as well there's your fireplace 
no floor vents so it's easy to clean and it's easy to sweep up as well because there's no rough lines or anything like that so it's easy to keep clean the only carpet you have is on these slide outs which is really nice then you go in here so in here is the back bunk house so you go inside here, and of course you got more storage in here for blankets, pillows, whatever you need, plus storage under here as well. You got your phone ports and plug in there too. And then you have your TV hook up here. So you can even put a mounted TV in here too if you want it, or just use it as storage. But you still have like nice deep cabinets right like a lot of cabinets and it keeps on going with the cabinets then of course you have your ladder here um and then the ladder folds out and then you got your back bunk area uh your top bunk which one side you can use for storage and then somebody can be sleeping up here as well or two people can sleep up here there's your foam ports and your plugins there and then of course you got up here as well nice bright windows too so gives you a lot of and you can even if you park it and they can look over overlook the lake so there's options for sleeping back here as well the one thing I do like about this one is that also you have the bunk here, which of course folds up, and then you got your couch here. So you can leave that down. Somebody can sleep up there, and you can fold out the couch. Or two people can be up there, and one person here, and you can leave the couch as is. But the couch is a hide a bed as well, so you can fold out this couch as well. And you still have a lot of space in here. You can close off this pocket door. This nice sliding door. Close this off and this can, can be the kids nice little getaway from mom and dad. Which is really nice because not only do you have like your TV outlets and your phone ports and everything like that. You have a bathroom back here too. With a tub and a shower. So you got a bathroom back here as well a little medicine cabinet sink storage toilet and a door where you can access so the kids don't have to go in and out through the kitchen and living room they can access straight from here their own little bunkhouse right it's kind of nice a little bit different setup and of course this slides out And we go back along here. So we go back out here. Here is your station to control everything and get updates on everything. Your furnace, your voltage, all that good stuff. Here is your bathroom. A nice, big, bright bathroom with a skylight. So if you're an extra tall person, you still have a lot of that headroom. And then here you've got your caverns for more storage even more storage down in here outlets lights and fan and more storage under here a nice uh, deep sink too and then your medicine cabinet as well nice porcelain toilet too so it can handle those harsher chemicals rather than the plastic and then straight through here you have the bedroom so the bedroom, you have a nice king-size bed, a nice king-size bed, 
with windows, docking station, and shelves on, on the sides there. There's your docking station there, your shelves. And then you got a dresser here with some storage and stuff like that. Nice big, like you can put your shoes in here or whatever you want. Nice big closet. You've got extra shelving up top. Of course, your coat rack. And then in here, and these are lovely slide doors too. And then in here, of course, you got your washer dry your washer hookup, washer and dryer hookups there. So you can do one unit or the little side by sides, whatever works for you. But if you had the just the one washer and dryer all in one, it's kind of nice. So now, we'll, and of course, you got your AC back here too. Nice ceiling fan. Look at the lights over the island. So it'd be nice and bright as well. You got these awesome little pocket lights everywhere, which is great. Coat hook right off the entry. Then we go down on the outside, and I'll show you the outside here. So, of course, you got your outside speakers. And then here you have your LP Quick Connect, but we're going to open this up so that you can see your outdoor kitchen. So you have your outdoor kitchen here, your light switch, extra storage, nice sized fridge, so like a full size camping fridge, <coughs> no wood, which is nice. So if this gets wet or if you spill. <clears throat> you don't have any wood on here that will damage it. Nice sink and more storage up there as well. There's your door to access for the bunk bathroom. Your hitch on the back for those bike racks or anything like that that you may need. <coughs> Furnace and everything. This is really nice. So here you have, of course, your outdoor washing station, right? If your kid's feet are dirty or whatever, the dog. Your cable and satellite connection, your water stream and all that. Your flushes and your all your hookups there. Power cord. And a nice through heated containment. And look at the space. Like you got a lot of storage over here. A lot of storage over here. And it's a nice through and through one. Propane on this side. Then your auto leveling kit and your docking lights. Here is your spare tire and battery. And you can add another battery too if you want. It's there if you want it to be done. Another propane, and then this is the other access. Of course, there's your leash for your dog, if you have a dog. And it's underneath the awning, so a nice shaded area for your dog as well. Light switch, cable connection. So you could even, if you wanted, you could put a TV right here and just have it come slide out. Then you got your outdoor entertainment center as well with your outdoor kitchen. Like, how lovely is that? I like the tinted glass too, so that stops the heat from coming through. It gives you a little more extra privacy as well if you wanted to leave the blinds open. So that is your 22 Sabre 38D BQ. 
If you have any questions or concerns, by all means, you can give me a shout. My direct line is 780-977-2138. And again, my name is Leanne, and thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I hope you have a wonderful day.